Oh, look what the cat dragged in. I'll have a mochaccino, extra marshmallows, hold the attitude. I thought you were off around the country, showing your wares. Mm -hmm. Is everything OK? Fine. I'll tell your mopey mug, or better leave. You're bad for business. OK, fine. I'm not fine. There you are. No. Dizzy, it doesn't matter if you cheated with Robbie you cheated? or whoever. Where there is true love, like you and Damo. Sorry, Leanne, it's never really over. Like, haven't you watched Dirty Dancing? When Harry met Sally. Labyrinth. Labyrinth. Oh, do not pretend you wouldn't go there with the Goblin King. Hmm? Anyway, my point is, Damo loves you, and you love Damo, and that is all that matters. So, I'll be seeing you at our place for lunch. What? Pork roast. Our place. Later. What? But I'm working. Rob was my 80-year-old B&B host. I left my charger behind. I just wanted Damo to be jealous. Oh, for goodness sake. You need to grow up and start acting your age. Well, I'd rather act my shoe size, thanks. And besides, he's the one making up stories about hypnotism. They are not stories. Carla was a piece of work. She took more than one person for a ride. She even drove a wedge between me and Nicole. Are you sure you had nothing to do with that? Damo is a brilliant man, but for some utterly baffling reason, he's chosen you. Which means that you can't be all bad, but take it from me, if you don't stop playing games, he'll get tired and you will end up all alone. So buck up your ideas. I'm gonna miss you, Uncle Eddie. I'm gonna miss you too, buddy. I can't believe you're really going. It's only a couple of hours away. Whose side are you on? It's not that I'm not sad, I just... Well, but you know what it's like. We'll get busy, you'll get busy. Eddie will be back here every week to drop Kiwa off. You will see him. <laughs> well, it's not Eddie that I'm worried about, it's Kiwa. <laughs> You'll see Kiwa as much as you want, I promise. And where is he? Uh, Esther's dropping him off at daycare. I'm gonna pick him up before we hit the road. So you're not gonna see Esther before we leave? Yep, she popped in this morning. Eddie? It's fine, it's not like I'm never gonna see her again. But this is your goodbye breakfast. She should be here. Oh, well, I've got a couple of last minute things to pick. Thank you for breakfast. Well, promise me you'll send videos and call me every day. Oh, maybe not every day. <laughs> oh, but you know what I mean. I don't want Kiwa to forget who I am. Never. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Oh. See ya. See ya. Bye. 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 Oh, not seeing Kiwa every day. God, Esther must be beside herself. I can't imagine. And I won't ever. Oh, oh but you are. You're my baby. Everyone, everyone, everyone. <laughs> Seems to be handling it better than I expected. Mm, she's one strong woman. Mm. Well, if anyone tried to take my babies away. <laughs> you gave Eddie away? I didn't mean that. Yes, and it was very painful, and that is why I am so triggered by this whole situation. Uh, well, how, how about lunch today? I mean, we've both got the afternoon off. Yeah, we could do a picnic. Yeah, you can in a cup. Well, I'm not sure. You'd have to ask your mum. Don't want to intrude. Look, the, the last few months have been really tough, mum. But Carla's gone now, and I want my family back. The picnic would be lovely. Saskia, what's up? Wilder what? Which hospital? <laughs>